wildcat way. Follow the wildcat way. Respectful, responsible, safe. Cooperate, make this place great. Good morning and welcome back everyone. Today is Monday, September 12th, 2016, and this is an E-Day. We're talking again this week about our Wildcat Way skills. We're gonna talk a little bit about being safe and respectful this week. And I brought along a little bit of a, um, just a reminder. This traffic light helps us remind, a, um, helps remind us about our voice level here at the primary. Green voices mean you can be loud and as loud as you want, yelling, playing, having fun. That's a playground kind of voice. Yellow are the voices that we use typically in our classroom during partner work or when we're sitting in the lunchroom um, chatting with friends. Red is our hallway voices or when the teacher asks you to do some independent work. That means red means no voices at all. Our hallways are no voices at all areas in our school. Why? Because other kids are trying to work and learn. That's how we are respectful, by showing them that we, are, we appreciate the fact that they're working and learning in our school. So what are the hallway rules in our school? Number one, we walk at all times, and that's to just keep us safe. We walk at all times. Two, we keep our eyes forward. Three, our lips are zipped. That's that no talking rule we have in our school. Um, and third, we keep our hands in a pretzel. It's really important to keep your hands to yourself so they're not on your neighbors, or your friends, or the people next to you, or even on the walls or the artwork. The janitors work really hard over the summer to paint our school and get it clean. So when we rub our hands against the wall, it gets our school dirty, and it could damage someone's artwork that they've worked so hard on. So be respectful and keep your hands in a pretzel. And the last one is um, to ignore people who are trying to turn around and talk to you. Might be your good friend who wants to tell you a story or make you laugh. The thing you should do there is just ignore and wait until an appropriate time to talk to them. So keep your voices off and don't answer questions if somebody's talking to you. So remember, when you're walking in the hall, keep your eyes ahead, keep your hands in a pretzel, lips are zipped, and eyes ahead, walking at all times. Keep our school safe and be respectful. With that, I want everyone to stand and face your flag for the Pledge of Allegiance and have a marvelous Monday.